If you've ever taken a sharp turn at high speed in your car and feared that you may come off the ground, you may have found yourself wondering how high-speed trains stay on the tracks during turns. And the answer to this comes in two parts. First is the shape of the wheels, which is the same thing that normal trains have to rely on when turning. Train wheels are connected by a fixed axle, ensuring that the wheels rotate at exactly the same speed. That's great when driving straight, but it becomes problematic on a turn. The inside track will be shorter than the outside track, meaning that the wheels need to cover different distances while rotating at the same speed. To solve this problem, train wheels have a slightly conical shape. During a turn, the outside track will run along the outside cone and the inside track will run along the inside of the cone, allowing them to cover different distances while rotating at the same speed. When it comes to high-speed trains, the only difference is that they turn very, very slowly. The turn radius of a high-speed train traveling at 270 miles per hour can easily reach 4.5 miles. 